The renaissance of the civilization in the old Meroetic era led to the emergence of a new hydraulic machine that led to the reconstruction of Nubia, extending the borders of the Kingdom of Meroe to the borders of Sinar and Kurdufan in Western Sudan. We will tell the story of the mechanics of the universe known to the first great man in the land of Nubia, which became an inspiration for the industry and the mechanics. A sagia or the water wheel consists of wooden and veneer parts and thick ropes made of a halfa plant. Its engineering parts consist of many important pieces. Ergadidol. It's the big wheel of the engine and its engineering mission is to pass the movement to the small wheel to increase its speed in circulation. The large ring consists of a number of gears, one of which is called in Nubian, Surgadi. Between these gears, there is space on the wheel's parameter used to balance the gears on the large wheel with the gears of the smaller wheel to begin the movement of the water wheel as sagia. The large wheel is centered on a vertical axis column called Mishi. This column has an opening about half a meter high from the axis of the wheel. In this hole, the back of a tuhum is placed securely half a diameter above the large wheel and extends to be a seat a ruti outside the parameter of the wheel. The pillar Mishi is based on two openings. The upper opening is Jiu. The Jiu is a long wooden trunk between the sides of the water wheel and is often curved. The lower hole is the sab, a panel fixed and mounted on the ground. al Tod, which is the smaller wheel, to which the movement is transferred from the larger one and is not different from it except in size. Its lower half is placed in a hole and the top is connected to the gears of the larger wheel passing through it a long axis column called Tore. The Argadin Tod is based on a seed called the Sab, near the base Mishi. The Tori column extends horizontally in the direction of the water collector similar to a small well, al Kode, known in Arabic as Kodek, to enter into another large wheel without gears called Atti. The Tori is based after coming out of a teak on another Sab installed on Asikak, which is a long, strong piece of wood that extends over the well and is carried by the legs of a sagia, the water wheel, on the sides of the piazza or well, in the case of a sagia, being placed on the banks of the Nile. Clay pots, known as gawadis, transport the water from the well to a sabaloga, which is the basin that receives the water coming from al -Gados, to be transported to the creek using buckets. This is the last sagia, or water wheel in North Sudan now, in 2018.